Uh, my name is James Devereux and I am a glass blower. I do enjoy a huge range of it really. Uh, I enjoy being able to create other people's ideas, help other people have their ideas and their dreams actually visualised and made into reality. Uh, currently I've been glass playing for about 14 years. I started off when I was 17. Uh, there's two routes I would see into it. Either get yourself known with a local glassmaker, show an interest, spend your time in the workshop, getting to know how it works, starting to lend your hand around when you can. Um, that's normally a good way to get to grips with actually how a functioning workshop um, works, get to know different glassmakers and gradually build yourself into the community that way. University can be a good way to learn. There's quite a few good universities in this country for learning glass making. There's one in Farnham, there's one in Wolverhampton, one up in Sunderland. There's probably the three main ones that are around. Uh, they're great for learning a broad scope of glass making and learning ideas on glass design and the history of glass. I wouldn't say they were focused so much on the technical skill side of glass making. I still say that side of it is the best learned actually within a workshop. I first got into glass bowing through work experience at school. Uh, from work experience at school I continued working for the same company in Bath uh, during weekends and school holidays whilst I finished off uh, my GCSEs and through college where I done art and design in Trowbridge. And then from there I went off to university to study glass in Wolverhampton and then after that went to work in a factory in Bristol. Uh, setting up the workshop has been a huge accomplishment for me. On a long term side of it it's very difficult to actually set up a workshop, keep it running, keep the customers coming through. Because a lot of what I do is not based around actually making a product and selling it myself and actually making things for other people, it can be difficult sometimes to make sure you've got a through flow of new customers and original customers, keep wanting work made. Um, technically, I do a huge variety of pieces from very delicate stemware, which can be very difficult because they can fall down very quickly, they can be very delicate and they can break, to much larger, heavier scale pieces which can be physically challenging and take a huge amount of time and say if they break then it's a huge amount of time for actually to redo it. Uh, during my time my career expanded from working in um, factories in Bath and Bristol, uh, working around different places in the Midlands during my degree. I worked at the Royal College of Art in London for three years as a technician. I started this place, this workshop, about five and a half years ago and about seven months ago I started it as a new company with my business partner, Catherine. During my career I've done a huge expanse of work from tableware, wine glasses, general production to things for TV shows and films uh, through to a lot of what I do now which is making work for different artists and designers who come from all around the world to get us to make things.